working on Chellin. Fade away, good for E.J. Anasicki. Three nothing, Pioneers. To Hawkins, 15 to shoot. Pass high from McLean on the baseline. He drives in and slams it down. Unique, indeed. Keeping pace for that double double that he usually gets. McLean, Chauncey from 15. Hawkins hits. He's got four, and the Terriers are back up three. Rebound, Ozier. And Kareem connects from downtown. He's got five points. Well, he just shows you on that play that you have to find him early in their offense. Well, he brought his scoring back on that bus right home. From now LaRose from downtown. He hits his first points of the day. They should go into a press or a trap. Millie's got seven, four off his season high. Deflected away. Here's Higgins coming in, one on none. And he outraces Thomas to the hole. Terriers cut it to five. To shoot, gives to Clark. Guarded by Hawkins. Spellman sets the screen. Clark pulls up. And the lefty jump shot, good. He's got nine points. Best for the Terriers. That's rebounding the basketball. He's got five now on the day. Chellin in trouble, kicks it out. Unique from downtown, McLean. So sweet. No, Scott Norwood, I beg your pardon. McLean can't get it to fall. Millie's there, puts it in, and he'll go to the line for a three-point play opportunity with the Terriers back on top. That's someone, if you're the Terriers, you gotta pay attention to, because those things can get you going. Chellin facing up Spellman. And the hook shot from the lane is good. The menace does it again. He's got 15. Working on Chellin. Ozier, inside 10 to shoot. Ozier from three, rolls it home. Kareem Ozier with his second triple of the day. He's got 13 as well. It's back to a one point. St. Francis Brooklyn lead. Gonna have to go in the game. Higgins ran into a hard screen by Spellman. This is LaRose with three to shoot, and he knocks down the triple. Cannon LaRose has been a terrier killer today. Ozier across the timeline. Terriers need another stop. Keep this a one possession game, but Ozier into the lane, gets it to go, and the foul on Kurtinich. Gives the Pioneers another chance for a three-point play. Puts up a three, it's off the front rim, no good. LaRose grabs the rebound and that will do it. Here at the Daniel Lynch Gymnasium, the Terriers fall to eight and two at home this season as they fall to Sacred Heart in the back end of this Saturday B-ball doubleheader. The final, Pioneers 83 and the Terriers 76.